Hi, and welcome to the GCSE questions. You can see right there, it says uh, Peter wrote down the ages and years of seven of his relatives, and here are the ages 46, 38, 42, 43, 39, 40, and 39. The first question is for you to find the media. In the first place, what does media stand for? That's the first question. So by definition, we can always say the media of a set of data is the middle value. And the middle value in this case, to get the middle value, all you need to do, I say, will you rewrite the data? When you rewrite the data, you end up with 38, 38, 39, 39, 40, 42, 43, and 46. So to find the media, all you need to do is count the numbers, one, two, three, and four, five, six, seven. So we all know that 40 is the middle value. Okay, the next question is for us to work out the range of the ages. So in that case, what is the definition to this? Okay, let's find out the definition. When you find out the definition, you can always get what the answer is. So, right there is the definition of what range is meant to be. Range is the measure of spread. You, you can also say range equals highest minus the lowest value. In this case, the lowest value is 38 and the highest value is 46. So you can, all you just need to do is say 46 6 minus 38. And that will give you 8. So let's look at the next question we have right here. The next question right here would like us to work out the mean. Okay, the mean in itself, what does that stand for? That is 8. The mean of a set of data is the most widely used average. So all we just need to do right there is find the average. So to find this average, we say we add up all of the data. 46 plus 38 plus 42 plus 43 plus 39 plus 40 plus 39. And what will that give us? And so when we add up all of these data, we arrive at 287 divided by 7, which is equals to 41. You can always use a calculator to verify that. Now, let's have a look at the very last question. The very last question says, find the mood of their age. In the case of mood, we're talking of the most often mode equals most often the most often data in this is 39 how do we know that 39 is the most often data if you look up here we have 46 ones 38 ones but in the case of 39 we have 39 twice so that answers the very question of the most often data, which is 39. So all you just need to do is enter 39 right there. And that is how you tackle this very simple working with data problem. And bye for now.